Previously on The Walking Dead. We just kill these folks and take all their stuff? Hey, Bonnie from Five Nights at Freddy's. What's up? Okay, I got one. A snake for a tongue. You're so bad at this. Would you rather have a snake for a tongue? Awful. Or lobster claws for hands? Mm. Can I control this snake, or does it have free reign? Free reign. Well... I'm thinking. Think harder. And how exactly do you think harder? Good point. I'll think about that. Snake tongue. Gross. What? How is it more gross than lobster hands? Well, for one, it's in your mouth. Hey, you asked the question, Hoss. Why does it matter if it's in my mouth? Well, I guess, ugh, gross. Okay, how about... Oh, never mind. I probably ought to stop bugging you with stupid hypotheticals. Oh, come on. You'd be a lot less fun. You've been a lot more fun lately. Feeling better? I guess I am. Well, you sure do look better. Though, so, uh, you gotta admit anything is an improvement. That came out wrong. Uh, what I mean is... I mean, uh, you were... Thanks, you were, Baka. Uh, you know. Thanks, jerk. Hey, that's what I'm here for. Oh, <laughs> to remind me how hideous I was. Nah. Make sure you keep on keeping on. I mean it, though. After we found you, you were still so hooked on that stuff. Well, I never thought you'd make it. You ain't out of the woods yet, I know, but... Well, you've come a long way, Bonnie. And I'm proud of you. Oh, shut up. What are you, my sponsor? I'm the best you got. God, Sell out. help me. Look, you know I ain't going nowhere, right? As long as we're together, I'll be there for you. You ain't gotta worry. You know that, right? What are you saying? Bonnie, uh... Leland? Oh, damn. Bonnie? D. Hey, honey. Look at him. I me. found us something. Oh, what are you two up to? Don't be rude. Just chatting, really. Just chatting. Chatting, huh? What about? Oh, um, uh, well, um, lobsters. Lobsters? Well, fishing. Figured it'd be worth a shot. For the food, you know. Leland, you hate fishing. Well, that ain't totally true. And how many days you gone fishing? What? I go fishing all the time. Thought you, didn't I? I am a catch. Oh, I know it. I got you a present. Oh, you shouldn't have. What'd you find? I'll tell you later. I don't mean to interrupt your chat with your uh, girlfriend, but uh, we got to get moving. What? Girlfriend. So, where'd you get the bag, Dee? Dee? Dee, did you hear me? Keep up the pace, you two. Hey, Dee, when we get back to camp, would you let me borrow some of that nail polish? Sure, hon. You like this color? It's my favorite. And after today, I could use a new coat, you know? Same here. I feel like a drowned rat with these claws. Not to interrupt the girl talk here, but uh, Dee, that, that bad. Look, I found it down the road a piece, all right? Where down the road? Some place off that away. Damn it, Dee, you gotta give us more than that. Was anyone there? I don't think so. You don't think, or you don't know. Those mean the same thing, Leland. Just tell us, baby. You guys sure gang up on me a lot lately. Honey, that ain't true. Tell me one time you sided with me in the last week. The last month. All right. I can't remember one especially, but I know I have. False. This is how all our fights go. Every time. Now we're standing here in the woods, soaking through, and for what? 
Don't you want to get to the camp before dark? I ain't the one who stopped. The... But you are the one who made me stop. Irregardless, we could just as easy carry on like this while we're walking. Oh, I've about had it with that attitude. Attitude? And now we're standing in this goddamn rain, in this goddamn middle of nowhere you did place. That on purpose. You listen to me now. I have had it up to I here with listening to you. To blaspheme. I can't believe you are still religious after My what we've been ain't through. Something I wear like a fucking sweater. Don't just take it off when it gets uncomfortable. Bonnie, darling, I'm I'm sorry we're Darling. D come on. You call, Save it. You can call I know anyone what darling. Side your bread come is on. Buttered on. Yours too. D now's not the time. Whatever issues we got, we'll hash them out later. It's always later. I, I refuse to get in the middle of this. Well, too bad. You already are. Fuck you, no I'm not, piece of shit. I'm sorry. I just want to get somewhere where I can change my clothes, and then you and your girlfriend can Oh no. Oh god, run, come on, we gotta move. No, what are you talking girlfriend. about? Fuck. Oh shit. Run, run, run. <laughs> Help me! God damn it. Run. Juke him out, juke him out. Do, 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 do. Ah, oh, that's gotta hurt a lot. Uh. Oh shit. And there's a- everywhere it gets- everything gets back to the prison bus. And pit stop. Yeah, be quiet. Shit. Ugh, dodge. Dodge. Just keep dodging. Oh god. Good job. This is a stealth mission. Ah, oh, Colonel. They went this way! You don't know shit. Colonel. Colonel. Shit. Where are you? Can't see a damn thing out here. Anybody got anything? God damn it. Anything? No, I can't see a damn thing out here. All right. Calm down. Oh, Mama, watch over me. Okay, Bonnie. Stay calm. Find a weapon. Ness? Uh, uh, pull it, pull it! Oh my god. I'm, I'm doing it. No, 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 no. Fuck, pull it. Never. Dark out here. 
trusted you. Just... Just a junkie. Leland. She... She did this to me. I... God, I'm so sorry. So... I can't... Oh, God, God! I knew you'd fuck up again. Take him. What? I... I... What? No, God, I'm sorry. I need him. I need you both. And there you wanted him, didn't you? Thank you. Had the stones. Oh, damn you. Leland is just a friend. I didn't mean to do this, Dee. I swear to God. You fucking junkie. Fuck off. It's a fucking not Dee. racist, but Dee, did you find might her? Well be. I, mean, I, I thought they got you back there. Jesus, are you shot? Yeah, didn't you see me get shot? Me? Oh, God, what happened? Oh, Jesus, oh, Lord, Bonnie, what happened? Oh, my God, D. Darling, what happened I to you? I had to do it. Your face? Her face, Bonnie? How did this happen? Why didn't you wait for me? Tell me what happened. She came out of nowhere. I thought she was one of them. I, I didn't see her until she was right there. You did this? You did this to my D? I don't... I don't believe this. I don't understand. How did it happen? Jeff, you see something? I just don't... Come on! Bonnie, why? I'm sorry. I'm so sorry, Leland. Bonnie... Oh, I no, feel sick. Going... Which way? There. I'm sorry to do this to you, darling. I'll leave you here. Call out if you this see him. way. I think I saw something over here. She's gonna die for this thing. I for damn sure ain't leaving it behind. There's no reason to comment on those. Jeez, legs are freaking bent. Christ. Hey, Shell, your sister's getting pretty good, huh? Becca had a good teacher, Steph. Thank you for doing that. She needs something to focus on besides, you know, everything else. Yeah. Growing up in a world like this, what do you think that does to a kid? She's already changing. She dismisses things she cares about so easily. I guess you kind of have to when you've already lost so much, but I still worry. Beck is a good kid. These are shit times, and she's gonna go through that. But if we can keep her from experiencing some of the shit I've seen... Thanks, Stephanie. Thanks. Becca, that was great. Thanks, sis. 
You think we can do something like this every week? As long as it doesn't distract from keeping this place safe, that's always the priority. That was amazing, Becca. Ooh. We could all use a little more music in our lives. Did I ever tell you that I used to play in a band? Yes, Roman, you've told us. She doesn't want to hear about it. They were it called again. the Roman numerals. All right, all right. In that case, let's get back to work. Oh, and thanks to name. Boyd's hard work on the vegetable garden, we're having fresh soup tonight. It's them from okay, season one. Okay, let's get to it. You want to help me and Shell do the supply inspection? Cool. You check the flashlights this time. I'll look over the guns. Cool. Actually, I wanted to make sure our blades were in good condition first. No rush on the flashlights. Shell, when you get a sec, meet me out back. Help me feed the watchdogs. Sure thing. Did you ever find out what happened there? No. Roman said it was like this when he and Stephanie found the place. Could be anything these days, though. Still, better not to think about it. This is where the tool couple was shot. Eesh, these knives are looking pretty ragged. Don't worry, they're on our list. How are we doing on ammo? Better than we thought. We haven't had to use these for a while. What? Nothing. Okay, that's kind of creepy. What did Roman want? I don't know yet. Are you gonna find out? Yeah, in a sec. Don't fucking boss me around. Huh. Still one short. We never found the other flashlight? Nope. Still in the cornfield somewhere, I guess. Bonnie and fucking Leland. You guys need help? Nah, we got this. Right, Becca? You go ahead and help Roman out back. The diner looked pretty nice back then. That's because they used to pay people to clean it. Also, not as many dead visitors back then. True. That booty, though. Hmm. It'd be nice to get those windows fixed one day. We will. One day. One day, maybe soon. Looks weird in here without the paintings. Well, Boyd wanted something to paint his own pictures on. I guess it'll be a personal gallery in here when he's done. Nice. Oh, shit. Okay. You're the new Lee, apparently. Hey, Becca. Think we should start charging for the inspections we make? Oh, yeah. Then we can spend all our money at nowhere. I know, right? The best place ever since Walmart. We should do an inspection on these. Make sure they all work. Yeah, that should be a given. Glad we thought to bottle our water before it ran out. It's actually pretty smart. Why, it ran out here before the thing happened? It smells good. Yeah. I guess it does. I want some. Give me it. This hasn't worked in a long time. God, now I want some soda, man. God, what I wouldn't give for a cup of coffee in the morning. Would you give up an arm and a leg to a zombie? Ooh, starting to thin out in here. Thank God we have a garden now. Yeah, it's got like the best fucking place here, actually. I don't miss going on raids for this stuff. I don't think anyone would miss doing that. Jesus. Oh, you scared me! He's hungry. I guess he knows it's feeding time. It's the guy from the Vince's bus thing. It's not an animal, Roman. Well, it's not human either. 
Not anymore. You know, uh, your sister said she wouldn't mind doing this. Roman, we've talked about this. Becca doesn't need to deal with this kind of thing. Listen, I know you think that giving her an easy life is what's best, but it's really not. I know, I just want her to have a little more time to be a kid. As long as she knows how to protect herself, it's fine. I don't want her to stop caring about people. Okay. I mean, okay. What's that one? Do you agree? I don't know. I'll check it out. I gotta get back out front. Looking forward to that soup. Alright. Delicious soup. Hey, Walker. Fine, you piece of shit. Don't share your food. Try to talk to you? You're like, nah. It's like, fuck you then. Hey, what's up? Oh, wow. They have basketball here, man. Didn't expect that. Jesus. You just like picking out, don't you? Eat the intestines like pussy. I don't know. Oh, like the food. God. What is that? No. Golden Retriever puppy, no. <laughs> Fuck you, asshole. I don't like the sounds, they're actually kind of creepy. You're not even eating it. Fuck you, too. Fine. Later. Ah, oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, Jesus, don't ever fucking do that again! Whoa, calm the Whoa. fuck down. What's your problem? I do this all the time. You don't get all pissed off. I'm sorry. It's... It's just the watchdogs. I guess they found a, a puppy. A puppy? Yeah. I guess it just got to me. You know, it was... It was so little. You don't think about babies anymore, but... After a while, you just kind of accept... This is it. Yeah. I guess you kind of forget. <laughs> right? But then, you know, there it is. You see it and you want to protect it and... And now it's gone. That sucks. Maybe if Clive dies next, we can put him out there instead. He'd make a better watchdog anyway. Becca. Shell! Becca, something's going on outside. Oh no. What I... is it? I don't know. Something bad. We gotta find Roman. Come here, everyone. Shit. Come on, we gotta find Roman. Miss Mom. It's so okay to be there. Jesus. Largum. My God, Largum. what did you do? All I did was put on the blindfold and bind his wrists. Somebody else beat him up. He already had the cuts and bruises. Watchdogs caught him trying to steal supplies. Is he bitten? No, they didn't get that close. Did he hurt anyone? No, thank God. Who is he? I don't know. And I don't think he speaks English. I can't believe he just snuck it's in. The second break-in we've had in the last couple of weeks. Last time we couldn't catch him. And they got away with more medicine than we could afford to lose. We all know what it's like trying to survive out there. He just came in here for food. Let's just give him some. And send him on his what way. What if there are more of them? He could have been scouting. That's right. He could be part of a larger group. If there were more, I think we would have seen them by now. I mean, nobody travels alone by choice anymore, right? We can't take the risk of letting him go, but why not let him stay? I guess that would be okay. We could always use more hands keeping the place secure. Boyd, we don't need any more people here. And look at him. How is he he can't even speak English. This group works because we know how to communicate. That's racist. <sighs> We can find a way for him to help. Well, he's not staying here. 
You let in a stranger, and everything starts breaking down. And the last time we did that, we lost Bree. And then Vernon with that goddamn boat. Vernon and the boat are the reason the group fell apart. Not trusting strangers. He made us beat up that guy with the mustache and steal his boat. We did that. I've regretted it ever since. That hey, asshole. when our group fell apart. He can't stay here. I agree. Keeping him here is not an option. In his condition, he'd be a drain on our resources. Look, we all know what we're talking about here, so let's stop dancing around it. We either let this guy go and take our chances, or we kill him. Jesus Christ! Are you serious? Roman's right. It's gotta be one or the other. We're letting him go. It's the only right thing to do. I'm telling you, we can't do that. But killing him? Is that really the answer? Stephanie, Boyd, you two don't think we should kill him. We know where Joyce and Clive stand on the subject. You're the swing boat here, Shell. What's it gonna be? How are you, Roman? Sorry, man. Uh, fine. I guess this is what we have to do. There's gotta be another way. Tell me, what if he comes back? With weapons, or, or a gang? Is it worth losing any one of us? Jesus, there really is no other choice, is there? We can't keep him here, and we can't let him go. Let's mop them. If there's even so a chance of him coming back or telling folks that might try to hurt us, you can't risk it. I won't ask you to watch, but if we do this, we're all in it together. If this ever happens again, it's gonna be one of you pulling that trigger. Do you have any fours? Nope. Do you have any sevens? Yep. I miss playing guitar for everyone. It was stupid, but fun. Why don't we do that anymore? After we had to kill that guy, there's a lot we don't do anymore. I wish things were still like they used to be. Well, Roman's too focused on making sure no one's able to break in again. You know that's impossible, right? Well, after last time, Roman isn't taking any chances. Then I should fix the loose board behind the storage lots. Becca, are you sneaking out again? Oh, God, do you know how dangerous that is? It's not dangerous. There's nothing out there but slow-ass walkers. What are you talking about? We've had two break-ins already. Anyone could be out there. What if someone sees you and, and follows you back here? They won't. Damn it, Becca. Shell, I need to talk to you. It's open. What's going on? Hey, Becca. Hey. When you uh, get a sec, I need you to come out and talk to me. It's important. Okay. I'll be outside. You'll see me. Give us a minute. Yeah. Just don't take too long. What was that all about? I don't know. Probably not good, though. Stay here. It'll be just a minute. I'll fill you in when I get back. Bloodstain from the when we shot the guy. Oh, we shouldn't have done it. We 
really shouldn't have done it. Well, it's better than getting one of us killed if we let him go. How come no one's watering these? I don't know. It's kind of stupid that they're not. Yes, that's a painting. Can you please? Hey. Shell. It's Stephanie. What? Roman's got her locked up like some kind of animal. They said she was trying to escape. They actually used that word. Escape. Boy, calm down. I knew something like this was going to happen, Shell. I said if we killed that man, we were heading down a dangerous path. And now look where we are. I'm gonna go talk to Roman. No, no, just take Becca and get out of here. You know I can't do that. Things are good here. We just have to stick together and follow the rules. Just don't do anything stupid. Looks nice, Boyd. Thanks. Really does, man. You're a good artist. Good job. Hey, I heard about Stephanie. Why did she have to do that? We're safe here. There's no reason to want to leave. I'm sure she had her reasons. I'll go talk to Roman. We'll figure it out. Let's hope. All we can do is hope now. Is this really necessary? Roman? Good, you're here. I heard about Stephanie. I'm sorry. What are you gonna do? You know what we do. What happened? We caught her trying to escape. Maybe she wasn't. Maybe she just wanted to get outside these walls for a while. Ever since the incident, you've made this place feel, I don't know, oppressive? We've made it safe. She was definitely trying to escape. She had most of our ammo and medicine with her. She screwed us, Shell. All of us. And now we're in that position again where we can't keep her here and we can't let her go. You do know why I'm telling you this, right? hear a banging in there thing. Yeah. He said that next time it'd have to be one of us. You went along with it last time. You weren't convinced it was the right thing to do. Now I need to know that you're with us. A hundred percent. But she's one of us. Th this is different. No, she's not. Not anymore. She tried to sneak out and leave us without any medicine or extra ammo. She knew that could mean the death of any one of us. You got your gun? It's in the camper. I'll give you a few minutes to get your head together. God, what do I tell Becca? That's up to you. Whatever you say, I'll back you up. Shell? What's wrong? Am I in trouble? It's Stephanie. She stole a bunch of supplies and tried to escape. Oh my god. What the hell did she do that for? Roman says we have to... Kill her? Yeah. Why would she do this to us? She's just scared. She made a mistake. That'll be our last mistake. Becca, Stephanie is your friend. Was my friend. Fuck Christ. Roman wants me to do it. I'm sorry. You're all pissed off now you're sad again? Let's just get it over with. Fucking stop having there. mood swings. In the drawer. 
Christ, stop with the mood swings. Are you okay? Do you want to talk about it? No, I don't. Just want to get it over with. I don't want this to be who we are. Just let me do it then. Fine, do it. Fine. Go ahead. No! Roman said he wants you to do it. I'll do it when it's my turn. So I fucking this thought. Really sucks. Yeah, it does. You know, we don't have to do this. We can just go. What? We've survived on our own before. If we just go, we can be out of here before anyone can do anything about it. Are you crazy? Where would we go? There's nothing out there. As long as we're here, we're safe. The group will protect us. But for how long? I don't know. Longer than we'd survive out there. Besides, you know the rules. If we try to leave, Roman will hunt us down. We don't have a choice. This is who we are now. Shell, it's time. Why now, huh? Why do we gotta do it now? And Shell and Beck, uh, Becca look just like the people that were, they are the people that were running out uh, during Vince's story, out the window. Not killing anyone though. Especially a girl with a nice booty. What are you doing? Shell? Shell, what the hell? Sit down, get safe. Shell! Hey! Shell! Will be safe? Oh, I promise. No, he won't! What the fuck? Oh. God damn it! Take care, Boyd. Was a good boy. We were right. There are survivors out here. Still alive? Oh, they're gonna be happy to get rescued. So how many are we talking about? Around five, I think. They left a note, so at least we know they want to be found. And I can see smoke in the distance. Probably a camp. I'm gonna try to make contact tonight. Great. Well, just be careful and use your best judgment. We're building a good community here. We want to keep it that way. Of course. Campfire and singing the campfire song. I'm gonna try to talk to him. Wish me luck. Yeah, good luck. Be careful. Don't try to force him into anything. Just get as many of them as you can. You got it. Hey, don't spit. <laughs> don't fucking move. Who the fuck are you? My name is Tavia. How did you find us? what I do. I found your note. I'm a scout for a growing settlement up north. We go out and look for survivors to rescue them. We have food, clean water, and shelter for everyone. We're offering you a chance to help us out and start over. God, this sounds too good to be true, but I think it is. Bonnie, get real. Just because you have to tell the truth all the time doesn't mean everyone else does. If I didn't trust people, I'd be dead. I know that for sure. People can care about you if you let them. Like Leland cared when he let you run off alone? That's enough, Becca. I heard rumors about these places. This guy I was traveling with ditched me trying to find one in his own. He thought... You know what? Let's do this. She looks well-fed, right? And clean? We could all use a meal and a hot shower. Hold up. I know that's we don't know what kind of what? people we're dealing with. I don't want to get stuck with some crazy asshole like Russell did. I walked away from that shit, Wyatt. 
And that dude was crazy from Jump Street. <laughs> Look, we need people, plain and simple. You folks can decide if you want to come as a group or split up or whatever. But I don't want to be out here in the open after dark. So in a few minutes, I'm going to be getting back in my car and on my way. Hopefully, at least some of you will follow me. Well, I'm going. Maybe we should go too, sis. If Roman is still looking for us, he wouldn't be able to do anything to us there. There's no way that guy is still looking for you. We've been to that truck stop. There's no one left. Roman's not a problem. It's following her that'll get you killed. Look, I know it's a risk, but what else is there? If you guys are going, then so are we. I don't like this, guys. We should just walk away. I don't trust her. Of course you don't, Russell. You don't trust anyone. What will it take to convince you? I don't know. Russell, come on. Guys, trust me. We need to get to this place. Well, it could be a trap. What if they want to kill us? You Thank just you. asked to join, and now you're crazy. like, oh, what? We've all seen it. Well, we turned out all right, didn't we? Relatively speaking. What are we going to do? Eat you? Are you going to eat us? <laughs> no, 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 that was a choke. No. I'm sorry. Look, I, I mean, know you Saint guys John's are married, would, but... and you have every right to be. You don't know me from a hole in the ground. And yeah, there are some crazy fuckers out there. All I'm here to do is make an offer. You can come with me, or you can stay here. The choice is yours. So, who wants to come with me? Yeah. I'm going. I can't tell if Vince is like sarcastic about it or not. It's like, yeah, let's go. They probably had nice food and shit. It's like, what? Can't tell. I'm, I'm just not sure. We've been out here for so long and seen so much bullshit. I mean, is it really worth getting our hopes up? Of course it is, Russell. Hope is all we've got left. But being smart, that's what's keeping us alive. Some of you may have been separated from friends or family. It's a long shot, but there's a chance you could find them there. Have your people been through Statesboro? Yes, I think we have. Okay, but I swear to God, if you try anything, you're gonna regret it. Yeah, and if you're not lying, maybe... Maybe Eddie will be there. We'll do everything we can to help you find your friends and family. But understand that I can't promise anything. We understand. I think we've all made up our minds. Well, I guess we have our group. What do you want to do with these? Nice ball cap. Why, even though you don't normally have one? This is a good thing. I know it is. Wait, where are you going? How do we know this will work out? What's the alternative? Staying out here? Whose foot did you shoot off? You and 30% of people shot off Danny's. Wow. A lot of people did not save. A lot of people actually went with Danny. Huh. Did you stay in the car? Get out. You and 50% of people got out of that car. It's 50. It's rock, paper, scissors, so it makes sense. Did you leave Nate or stay with him? You and most people left Nate because he's a piece of shit. Do you lie to Leland? 25% were honest so for some reason. Most people were lying. Did you leave in the RV or kill Stephanie? Most people left in the RV. And everyone left with Tavia. No one stayed at the camp. Nice.
sorry, Danny, man. I'm really sorry. Do anything to that cop, Nate. Now it's Telltales, The Walking Dead, 400 Days DLC. It has been a great ride. And I cannot wait until we start season two. Whenever that may be. And see you guys next time in whatever series I do next. Let's just hope it will be a memorable and great one. Take care, guys. Electric, out.